Alright, how's it going, YouTube? Today, I'm gonna be cracking open some, uh, 15 geodes, uh, from National Geographic. I actually haven't, uh, opened geodes up that many times. I've gotten this kit before, and these are all bags of separate geodes and stuff, but, uh, they're much smaller than what's gonna be in here today. And I've also opened up some, uh, they like, nodules and, and stuff like that. And I've got one geode that I'm not going to open because I got it at a Wild West museum and it's naturally shaped like a handgun. So I thought that was cool. So let's go ahead and start opening this up. This just came in last night uh, for my birthday. And uh, you see everything's out of the box and here's like a National Geographic thing, which you're already subscribed to. And this is like the guide of the type of geodes and how to open them and how they're formed and all. Some safety goggles, uh, a magnifier glass, and three s display stands. Okay, since I can't find my rock hammer, like my actual rock hammer, I'm just going to be using a normal hammer. Since I can't find my chisel, I'm going to be using an old railroad spike. No judgment. And also, I can't go outside, so I have to do this in my garage because look at it out there. It's snowing. Okay, let's get these geodes on there. Alright, safety goggles on. Let's pull on now. This looks like a nice one to start off with. Cue the time lapse. So earlier I cracked open five that are in their bags, and they're labeled bags too, and I'm going to crack open five more, so I'm going to do like three different times with five geodes each time. And actually, this is the one that I put in for the 11, the pirate nodule, and I'm not going to crack this one open. But basically, so all of these, um, I cracked them open, but I haven't looked at them that much and identified them, because I'm going to identify them. Uh, after this, or if there's no more time, just another video. Here's a good one to start off with, and cue the time lapse. Okay, I did five more, and now let's go on to the final five. This one I'm just not going to crack open, and this is number 11, so let's just put that one in. Okay, so here's our next one, really light and easy. Probably more hollow than the other, so probably a bunch of crystals. Cue the time lapse. Okay, I'm back. I just finished the 14th geode, and it is time for the biggest one of all, the 15th. You can already see some crystals in that little cavity down there. Let's tighten it up in the vise. I'm excited to see what's inside of this. Okay, it's as tight as I can get it, so let's crack it open. see some nice crystals in there. Might not be able to see it on my camera, but there's a really nice terminated crystal from this, this geo, the biggest one. Okay, so here you go. These are the four, one, two, three, four different types of geos that were in this kit. Let's start off with uh, normal quartz. Geo number one was quartz. Geo number four was quartz. Geode number five was quartz. Geode number six was quartz as well. Geode number eight was quartz. Geode number ten was quartz. 
Geo number 12 was quartz. Some nice crystals in this one. And finally, Geo number 15 was quartz as well. Some nice stalactites or stalagmites. Depends on which side is top. Next, we have two geodes and bruisey quartz. Geo number 13 was quartz, and I actually saw, noticed this crystal that came out is a double terminated quartz crystal covered in druzy quartz. Thought that was really nice. And geo number 14 was druzy quartz. Next to the two I have in scepter quartz. Okay, so here you can see that geo number two is scepter quartz. And geo number seven has a few scepter quartz crystals in it. If I can focus. But there's really, there's big brown crumbly stuff you see it just breaks apart and sticks on your nails and stuff which i believe to be ancient mud our next our next group is pyrite nodules geode 3 was a pyrite nodule geode 9 was a pyrite nodule and i didn't open geode 11 because it's going to be the same as those two and it like the outside and this was a pyrite nodule thanks for watching please rate comment and subscribe